That's a Nazo Unicornus. Don't ask me what it is in Polish. But it hasn't got its nose fully developed yet. It's actually still quite small. That looks like a tang of sorts. Where did it go? Over there, yes, it is a tang. You can see the, the, the spine next to the tail. It's a tang. Don't ask me which tang it is. There's another tang down there. This is, a, this is I think, a regal tang. Oh, a cleaner rest just swung him into the frame. That's a cleaner rest. There's a nice couple. Uh, there's an angelfish down there, some kind of keated on, I think. I'm not an expert on marines, but, uh, oh, that's a regal tang, isn't it? That's a regal tang. So, so this guy's a, a big tang person with a special love, but this is one of my favourite fish of all time here, the Emperor Angel. That's really the highlight of this tank for me, the Emperor Angel there. Let's try and get some... Nice shots, where did it, where did they go? There's some nice clown enemies there with a nice anemone to play in. This is a really nice, decent size. If you want to take, uh, make a, a, a marine tank, then this is the way to do it. This, this is a good example, just the size of it makes it possible to have a whole big stable ecosystem and healthy marine fish. Yeah, the Emperor Angel is the, the king of the tank there. You're a beauty, aren't you? Yes, you know I'm looking at you. That's uh, a fish and a half, isn't it?